so it is very, very early at the morning and I'm just about to get on the train to go to Edinburgh for the meet and greet in the pop-up shop. Ooh. So yes, I'm going to Edinburgh right now. I just came back from there as well. Nell's doing a pop-up shop in Edinburgh where he's gonna have the merch, which is today, which is absolutely amazing. He's gonna have a nice meet and greet and I'm just gonna go down and experience what it is like. It's just gonna be so much fun and I cannot wait. But it is so, so early. And oh yeah, if you guys are new around here, my name is Mitchell Wilson and I do drama. <laughs> After all, it is now's big day. It's my big day! It's about to think that in two hours' time I will be back in Scotland. It just blows my mind, like, a lot. Mm. Oh, go away. <laughs> I love you. Love you. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> so just before we go into the actual event itself and the actual pop-up shop I just want to say it was an absolutely amazing experience and we will get to that But let's just talk about what happened before so obviously like you just saw at the start quarter past six in the morning I got I was just extremely tired if we're gonna be honest We were extremely extremely tired. We got into the taxi everything was running fine I get to the train station and I'm wondering what platform I am on and you know at this point I'm a bit like I need to find out I need to get my tickets. I only got about ten minutes uh, So the lovely people at um, Newcastle train station told me that it was on platform three and I was like, fine, jump on there, fine, we're on, on the train. I'm sat on the train, and I'm wondering, if something isn't right, there's, there's something that isn't right. As soon as the man comes round, tickets please, you know, he's, he's doing his thing, he's doing his thing, and all of a sudden, you're going the wrong way, mate. I'm like, what? What? <laughs> this one's going, this one's going down south, you need to be going up north. Oh. At that point on, I just... I wanted to break down and cry. But luckily the man did say to us, look, you can change over on the other platform when you get to Durham. We were in Durham for some reason. <laughs> and he said, we're going straight back up to Edinburgh, you can get off there. And I had to break it to Jay. The, the text, I just, I couldn't break it to Jay. And straight up, Durham is the other way, you idiot. I know, Jay, I know. <laughs> so I had to just get on another train. I had to get on a train going back up to Edinburgh. And eventually I did get there, but I was a session late. So I apologise that I wasn't at the first session for the people who went to that meet and greet, but for the other groups I did get there, so yeah, I hope you understand that situation now. <laughs> So when I got to Edinburgh, what happened was I was just like, I had the address, but I just didn't have a clue where it was. I know I was in Edinburgh not long ago with my girlfriend, but the thing was, I didn't know Edinburgh enough, because obviously it is a big, big city. So I'm walking down the street, I've got the Train Smart Keep It Real merch on, and also, big up to Jay for getting me the YouTube sensation top. I cannot believe Neil has got merch. <laughs> it's absolutely sick. It's really comfortable, nice fitting, and it just is a sick design. So if you do want to get one of these yourself, I will leave a link to nwclothing.co.uk in the description. Please do go check it out. Oh, it's got a plug. <laughs> anyway, I'm walking down the street in the hottest merch in the game I've got my black and red hoodie on and all of a sudden a girl comes up to me and she says are you going to the Nyla Wilson meet and greet and I was like yes so she was like do you want to jump in with us so I was like yes so I'm in a taxi with this fan and her mum and it was just really weird because they thought that I was a fan as well they had no idea it got to the point where we were just talking about Nile and she said so how long have you been following Nile's channel are you a gymnast oh I ain't no gymnast eventually I had to explain to them that well I'm his cousin and they were just like what? <laughs> like, this is weird. Like, of all the people to get in the taxi with us, I didn't catch either of the name either, but honestly, you were both absolutely amazing, and thank you so much for letting me jump in the taxi with you. That was very, very nice of you, and I hope you did have a good day as well. But yeah, apart from that, they were absolutely awesome. Like, they were such lovely people. I think they came all the way from Carlisle, and I hope she did have an amazing time coming all that way, because it, I just thought the event was amazing in itself. So eventually, we actually do find the meet and greet. We get there, I get inside, and I finally see everyone. It's just nice to see everyone, you know, Niall, Jay, Neil, Tom, Luke Ash. It's just sick to see all of them and just be together as a team. And just for me as well just to experience just meeting people who are huge supporters of, you know, the family and like what we all do and what Niall does especially. It's amazing how he's created this following online and even just where we went to one city, so many people turned up who were amazing, you were all sick. The whole experience for me was just like... I just, I've never experienced anything like that and being a part of it, it just felt nice. And for me, one of my favorite things that happened was, it was just weird for me, but honestly, it was like a nice feeling. Like I just, honestly, it was just so sick to talk to people about what we all do and stuff. And just even getting, you know, pictures and, and signing merch. I mean, I don't have the nicest signature in the world, but if you want it, you can have it. <laughs> like. <laughs> 
for me to be able to be a part of that and support the whole event and just experience it myself, it's just amazing and I couldn't thank everyone who was involved enough for that because it was just absolutely sick. And obviously for the people who turned up because without you guys coming to that it wouldn't have happened and honestly I really really hope you did enjoy everything that happened that day because I mean I know I did. So that was the one in Edinburgh now for the one in Birmingham and Manchester coming up this weekend I will be attending those as well and I'm really really excited to go to other parts of the country and see other people who are following Niall on his journey and following the family and everything we do like I cannot wait to meet more people be involved in more pop-up shops because they are just fun I, I just I love it it's just incredible I just I, I can't even put into words it was just awesome it was absolutely awesome. <laughs> Okay guys, so that's where we're getting the video. Just want to say thank you so much for watching and I hope you have enjoyed. Hopefully I will see some of you in Birmingham and Manchester this weekend. So if you are there, please do come say hi, wave at me, give me a high five. Anything you want me to do, I'll just do it because, you know, if it'll make you laugh, then easy. <laughs> if you guys have enjoyed this video, could you please leave a big, big like on it? That would be absolutely sick if you could do that. If you are new around here and you wouldn't mind smashing the subscribe button, that would be absolutely awesome if you could do that. We are trying to hit 5,000 subscribers before the end of the year. And if you could do that, that would be great. <laughs> and always remember guys, be influenced, be entertained, be inspired. <laughs> Take care.